This is Code Combat. I'm currently working on Computer Science 2, level 34, uh, Agrippa Refactor, and this is the Python version. Goal. Rid the meadows of ogres. Did you find the Agrippa defense difficult? Functions can help you clean up your code and make it easier to read. In this level, you'll replay the same scenario, but this time you'll solve it much more easily using functions that take arguments. When you want a function to accept arguments, list them in the declar in the function's declaration. So that means up here, right? We're making these parameters, which will be able to take arguments. So listing the arguments, future arguments up there. So this will say, Angie loves Bobby. Right? Because we're calling the function Valentine. The code looks around. What's Valentine? Oh, here it is. And variable A stands for Angie. Variable B stands for Bobby. So then the hero is going to say Angie loves Bobby. Then we're then it's done running at that time. Goes to the next line. Runs the function again. Except this time A is Bobby and B is Carla. And oh, well, that's so sad for Angie. Um, but Bobby loves Carla. All right? Let's see what we have. If cleave, remember, a hashtag is a comment. It's for programmers. The computer skips over it when it runs code. If cleave is ready, cleave. Otherwise, attack. So we want if uh, hero dot is ready. Yep. Cleave. So colon. Then we want to cleave. And make sure it's indented. Because that way, if the, we, we're asking, hey, computer, check if cleave is ready. If cleave is ready, it will run the code under your if that's indented. Since our parameter here is enemy, we can use the word enemy, because that's who we'll attack. Otherwise, so if it's not, else, colon, enter, attack. There we are. And so otherwise, if, if the computer, if this comes back false, the computer says, if cleave here is ready, cleave. No, cleave isn't ready, false. Well, then the computer skips this code and automatically runs else. Then it hits the bottom of the function and goes back down to run whatever else it was running. All right. Is that all we needed? Let's try. Awesome. Here's the code that worked for me. Let's keep going. 